today. <laughs> today I'm getting married. I'm getting baptized today. I'm so excited. Um, we're on our way to the church. We're supposed to be there at 10:15. It is 10:25, so we're late. I'm so excited. Um, I'm like, I'm not anxious. I'm just excited. I'm, I'm like ready to go. And yeah, like, and the, the funny thing is, I just want to tell y'all about this, my this baptism journey because I've been baptized once already, and to get rebaptized was kind of like a back and forth because I think I made the decision in September to get baptized again. And then, ooh, don't mind my nose. I made the decision in September to get baptized again, but it is actually October. It's November. It's November. <laughs> November what? 13th. November 13th, and that's when I officially got baptized. I missed one baptism because of a funeral, and I just basically wanted to share this story. If anybody is like feeling the want to get rebaptized. Um, because mine came over like my quiet time with the Lord and I promise you I heard this clearly it was you need to get baptized and I was like but I, I already got baptized um, but it kept saying like you need to get baptized and so um, in between time I honestly like just kind of never thought about it until my pastor called me recently and we went over the pledge and that's when I realized that I needed to get baptized because it was my first baptism was completely different from this baptism um I was first baptized when I was 11 years old and yeah it was completely different I think we focused more on my religion the first time and this time we really focused on like my relationship with God so it reassured my decision a thousand percent Ooh. Lady. Look at this lady. Okay. It reassured my decision 1000% to get baptized. I'm not getting rebaptized. I'm, I'm getting baptized because I know what I'm putting myself into this time around. And I'm going in with every yes in my body. Yeah, I'm getting married today. So we're going to, we're on our way to the church. We're probably like, Oh my gosh, we're gonna be so late. We're probably like 10, 15 minutes away. So we'll see you guys when I'm all dressed and you know they're doing the prayer. I can hear. No, you have to keep going straight. I mean you can, but I don't know the way to open it. Just keep going straight. But yeah, I'll see you guys when I'm all, you know, when I'm dressed in my white gear, you know what I mean? I'm all I'm all peered out, you feel me? Ah! Uh to go ahead and uh uh, now do the vows for our candidate for baptism. Today we are just so happy to have our dear sister Rose uh, for baptism. Put your hands together for her. Uh, she is indeed one who desires to serve the Lord with all her heart and abide by his commandments for the rest of her life. It is my prayer that today will be an amazing beginning of a new experience with her and her God. I'll go ahead and turn it over now to Ella Grant. Good morning, saints. We are so happy to have Sister Rose with us this morning. She has made that decision that she will follow Jesus all the way into the water grave of baptism. So I'm just going to do um, three statements with her. And then we are going to ask the church to do a, a vote. Sister Rose, I want to personally congratulate you on this decision to follow Jesus all the way into the water grave of baptism. And I'm just going to read three short statements, which um, I'm going to ask you to answer in the affirmative. I do or yes? Uh, your choice. Do you accept Jesus Christ as your personal Savior and Lord? Do you accept the teachings of the Bible as expressed in the statement of the fundamental beliefs of the Seventh-day Adventist Church? And do you pledge by God's grace to live your life in harmony with these teachings? 
And third, but not least, do you desire to be baptized as a public expression of your belief in Jesus Christ to be accepted into the fellowship of the Seventh-day Adventist Church and to support the church and its mission as a faithful steward by your personal influence, tithe and offering, and a life of service? Sister Rose, uh, we thank you for making this decision, and we are here to support you. I'm going to ask the church now um, to vote to accept Sister Rose as a full member of the First and the Adventist Church subject to her baptism. And at least I so move. Is there a second? <laughs> yeah, all in favor say I accept. <laughs> and uh, those online, <laughs> Sister Rose, you, you move me, have me a little emotional this morning with your tears. It is carried. Sister Rose is going to be accepted as a full member of the First Sunday Adventist Church, subject to her baptism. We want you to know that we are very, very proud of you, Rose. And we know that this is just the beginning of the amazing and great things that the Lord has in store for you. I'm going to invite the congregation to stand in support of Rose at this moment. And Rose because of the profession of your faith in the Lord Jesus Christ as your personal savior from sin. We now as ministers of the gospel baptize you in the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, and in the name of the Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 Praise God. Praise God. All right, guys. So I'm in the bathroom right now. It's it's been like like 30 40 minutes since i got baptized and i'm just so happy that i made the decision to follow christ and to just be one a member of his in his family and his army and to be like a princess you know i, I right now and i just want to make sure i can look back at this video whenever i feel discouraged i am not regretting my decision at all i know god was with me I know that I went into this 100% and that I am so in love with him. I'm so grateful for everything that he's done for me. I feel so loved. I feel complete. I feel worthy. I feel like I have a best friend. I'm, I'm just really happy. I just want to make sure I can go back and reflect on this and, and I can just know who is my anchor who is my lord and savior and who is my best friend that's jesus christ okay okay guys so i'm driving again <laughs> okay guys we are on our way back home we had dinner i didn't get to film the beginning but i definitely filmed the end it was literally like a reception and it was really a dope time with my friends and family and i'm so again i'm still happy that I made this decision period thank you guys so much for watching this video don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and I will see you in the sunrise bye